Factor make that several different sides. Who are you? I can tell you're very talented. Haney's the name, Mr. Haney from Hooterville. He's having an affair on him. Macy's having an affair with Jake. Can I tell my... Oh, I'm not going to tell my funny joke. I got a great joke, though. Tell me your funny joke. Well, you know, she's been carrying on with Jake, who is the tennis player. Right. So I've gone on a diet. The actor. Because I was very concerned that Macy was going to have to make a decision between Jake and the fat man. <laughs> but she's still seeing him. And uh, <clears throat> I wish them nothing but disease and awful things. <laughs> How did you get into this? What a fortuitous event. I was a recreational therapist for blind and retarded adults in New York City. I had my degree in psychology, and I came to Los Angeles to work with senior citizens. And while I was working with 1,500 senior citizens, I, got a, I started studying at the American Academy of Dramatic Arts in Pasadena for eight weeks, and I was cast as... To Danny Zuko in, in Greece, in the musical Greece. Yeah. And um, from doing that, I, I an agent saw my work, and I ended up getting a part on One Life to Live in New York a few short months after that. And I stayed in New York. I did Loving in New York and lots of regional theater. It's kind of amazing how life takes twists. You know? Now, that is a bizarre story. That is truly a Hollywood story. I mean, if somebody wrote a script, that, I mean, who'd believe this? They say it's ridiculous. Mine kind of happened in reverse. See, I went through my struggle after I had success, after I was on Loving, and I had worked for a long time doing little regional theater. I went for like four years where I worked not stop. I went through starvation period in New York. Just mm -hmm. the actor striking. I couldn't get arrested. So <laughs> I was like working as a doorman, a waiter. I worked for a company called Little L's. I was cleaning out people's apartments, cleaning out their ovens and uh, doing all sorts of fun jobs like that. And then fate stepped in again. And then I just took the Cocker Spaniels and moved to L.A. and about two months later signed this four-year deal. It's amazing. This is a wonderful part about this business is, you know, 